This week on CFO Learning Pro, when you enter a formula, you get the formula instead of the result. All right, so hey, we have some data here. I'm going to insert a few rows, all IR, and I'm going to do equal count A of these records to count how many we have. And instead of getting the answer, 4, I'm getting the formula. And this is not a situation uh, where we're getting formulas everywhere. So, for example, if I would just put equal rand here, you know, of course, if we press uh, Alt or Control and the uh, accent key, uh, then we see all formulas everywhere. All right, that's the show formulas mode. That's also back here under uh, formulas, uh, show formulas. Let's see, right there. Yeah, so Control and the little backwards accent. Um, so it's not that we're getting formulas everywhere, but just uh, in this one spot where we entered this uh, cell, we got a formula. And what's happened here is at some point in the history of this spreadsheet, we used text to columns and chose that this column was going to be text, or we imported from Access or SQL Server and the field was defined as text. So you have to take the whole column, uh, go to the Home tab and see it's formatted as text, change it from text back to general. Now that does not fix the formula. Uh, you still have to come here and uh, I want to press F2 and enter in order to get it to recalculate. So it's uh, somewhere along the line, someone did data text to columns. Uh, we'll click next, next, and in step three, they went to the, that field and declared it as text. That's why I say always, always just leave this as general uh, and then you won't end up with any columns that are tagged as uh, text columns instead of just general.